Gideon. I work for Phytronic with stock ECU flex fuel systems. We develop and build ECU uh, uh, systems for these cars. And what they do is they integrate into the stock ECUs of these cars and they allow us to run ethanol and pump gas, any mixture. We write the code into the ECUs and it blends it as over 256 maps, basically how it interpolates. Um, what we can do with these cars, it's, it's a couple hours to install. We have uh, different sponsors and uh, tuners that we currently work with. Right now we work with English Racing and TS Comp Tuning. Uh, this car right here is a 2003 Evo 8. Uh, we've done nothing to modifying the wiring harness. It is completely plug and play. This has a fully built motor, GSC S2 cams and everything. And if you can see in the car right here, uh, the customer has integrated into the dash uh, the controller built for the flex fuel system. Okay, so this is the controller we have, and this runs down to the OBD2 port, and then it also goes into the controller box, which is uh, underneath the dash in here, and then that plugs into the ECU. And there's three different options on this controller. Um, right now you can see the ethanol content and fuel temp uh, on here. He has this just placed into the car. The AFRs if the car is on, the battery voltage, and... Uh, stuff like that. What this can do is we can read up to four different values at once and there's many other things that we can display on this and anything that you have in the ECU that you can run in like uh, Evo scan or anything like that, all those parameters, we can have that displayed on this. So you don't actually need to have multiple gauges. And one of the great features of the system is that we can add any type of device to it. So let's say that if you want oil pressure or temperature, anything like that, um, we can take that sending unit and wire it into the controller itself and then have that display up here. And so this is one of those great things where you can save money, you can save weight, and it's, and it's a very, very awesome setup and it's very reliable. We have many cars running this. We haven't had a failure in a single car. Um, there are fail safes with the setup, so if there is an issue, uh, a wire comes loose or anything like that, uh, it will lock the values in during the pull so you won't have anything that will cause an issue and then it will revert uh, to prevent anything from happening. Another awesome feature with this is it uh, interpolates your, all your timing, your boost, and your injector values. So uh, whenever you add fuel or you add ethanol to the car, and if you have electronic boost controller, it will change all those values for you so you don't have to worry about it. If you have a manual boost controller, everything will work the same except you have to actually physically drop the boost in the car. Uh, but as far as this works, uh, it's completely hands-free, hands-off. So as you can see in the engine bay in this car, it's very beautiful, very clean. Uh, right here is the ethanol content sensor. This runs back into the firewall, and then that plugs into the box. So as you can see that there's nothing that really cuts into this car, all the wiring stock, there's no like, it's completely unmolested setup. Um, so basically, that's what our system looks like. It's very simple. Um, they're not very expensive. If you go to Northwest Knights Motorsports, Dot com or nwnmotorsports.com you'll see that uh, we have a, a, a full display of what these systems offer all the safety features and everything like that and if you'd like to get tuned contact English Racing or TS Comp Tuned